Everybody loves talking about the grind. Everybody loves talking about what it takes to make it in a business. This is not a story of someone trying to make it. We already made it. We're a $100 million company a year. We've already built a brand and a status within the industry, but that doesn't mean that we're done. Not only am I going to show you some of the behind the scenes, I'm also going to show you what it takes to run a $100 million company a year and take it to a $300 million company a year. It's really hard to keep a $100 million beast afloat, and it's even harder to take it to the next level. So stay tuned, and welcome to Gray Market. After one day off, Monday morning, bright and early, we're off to IWJG. That Saturday night, Anna and the three kids came in, including my son Marcus, who insisted to go to IWJG with me. And the minute the watch cases hit the showcases, the action was on. Adrian. New, new. Do you want a naked platinum Daytona for 95? Just put it to the side stuff. Naked closer. platinum Daytona for 95? Not really. Nah. No. You want with the card for 105? See? It's not see. I want to dump it. No, but like. <laughs> dump it? Yeah. I have too many pieces. Maybe you guys trade something. They're the new reference? One, two, sixes. Yeah, brand new. Green card, the whole deal. Pull them up. How much is the old JJ? It's 4,800. See, it means I come too late. Yeah, if you don't get in here early tomorrow, forget it. <laughs> Hour one is when all of the action happens, especially at IWJG show. People crowd into the room, scared that they're gonna miss a deal because as soon as things display, people start crowding the showcases and you wanna be the first one in the room not to miss a deal. You can't do the Pepsi closer to 20? I can't, I can't, it, this, I know it's a stupid ass thing to say, but I can't replace it. So and Bitcoin is up today. Bitcoin. Bitcoin is up. How much money I've lost? You have to, you got to charge prices in accordance with There's cryptocurrency. Okay, I promise you. Okay, everything is at a 40% discount of what it was last month. Uh, I'm last talking street. about from yesterday. <laughs> All right, let's go. Let's okay, do something. I make a joke here about cryptocurrency, but in reality, it's actually a lot of truth in that. If people see their accounts going down or they see their accounts going up, they make emotional purchases based on that. So that's why I was saying crypto is up today and the Pepsi is up today. 12.5. They're, they're on the chats right now at 12.5 at 2021. So okay. 13.8 for the subs. I can pay 13.5 a piece if they're complete. No, can't. I can't. I can't. You, do, you know how marginal it's this is. Our guy Alex will, will throw this up on Instagram. 14,000 is going. I'll, I'll I'm saying right? more. I I'll charge you more. That's what I sell. How's Alex doing? He's doing well. For real? Yeah. Okay, if you want 13.5 a piece, I can take. I can't. I mean, 10.5, I'll, I'll take it for the use. This new 15.8. Can't. 16. 16 was all. Bro, the pa the package no, no, the package no, of this bro, marginal it's, it's, shit, it's, it's like it's, I don't need to, you know. I'll do the best. Even number 37,000. 37.7. Okay, that's that's the full ask. No, no, I, I took a few, a few, took a little, little, little bro. Oh, thirty-seven six, bro. This is this is this is pennies. There's no problem. Come on, like thirty-seven two bleeds. And I, I have I have a headache. I got allergies and shit. Like, yeah, I'm hungry. I need coffee. Thirty-seven two. Thirty-seven six. Sure, bro. Come on. Thirty-seven four. Sasha, invoice from thirty-seven six. No, 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 bro. We just, we just, so thirty-seven five for round number. Bro, that's bro, that two that two hundred dollars is like ten percent off the profit. No, 30, so. Bro, it's $100, 375. I'm going down the middle oh. to make it even number. He's sending me boxes. Boxes, he sure? Yeah, it says box of papers, yes. That's for the retail. <laughs> Marginal Rolex deals is the number one thing you're going to find at trade shows because Rolex is king and steel Rolexes are definitely king. So when you're exchanging pieces amongst dealers, that $200, that $300, even sometimes $100 is almost half your profit. Ian, you think it's bad that I'm wearing the same shirt I wore last time at the show? People are going to think it's the same footage over and over? Should I hold up a newspaper or something? <laughs> <laughs> oh, those fake? Ooh, Ian, let's get this guy. My son, the sneaker expert, immediately spots a guy wearing fake Yeezys. Mm. Guy's wearing a $30,000 watch and a fake pair of Yeezys. Mm. Is, he ro is he really rocking the fake? He's rocking some. The, on, that's uh, not even the fake, that's the fufu. How about you? I'm good, I'm good, brother. This is the best looking 72 year old I know, by the way. <laughs> look at him. How, how old are you, Alfredo? How old are you? 52. Look at him. When I grow up, I want to look like him. So, what can I show you? Oh, you see it? I told you. It's I'm holding, nice I'm one. holding price. It's I don't care. Nice now the other ones, they fetched an auction 120, 125, I think. And I'm very happy that you and showed this, someone the book that sent to you. Yeah. So this, this. It's, it's a beautiful I watch. It's it's but now with the other ones fetching the money. I told you it's beautiful. It's kind of that, it's amazing. You should buy it. Told you. I will sell it to you now for 102. Uh, it's more to 
What do you think of this, Fredo? The controversial Kanja. As you said, I'm 52, so no glasses. It's like being blind. Yeah, I, I forgot my glasses. The problem is, is the Kanja at 6 o'clock was always controversial because most likely it was done no. in Oman. Well, it's not exactly that. There is a story of the Kanja at 6 o'clock right. with uh, uh, 665 six, yellow gold, which are legit, and they were sold in Denmark. Because it, it, apparently it was a kind of gift that Kabus gave to Denmark officials. Yeah. So it doesn't mean yeah. anything. Listen, I'm asking 250. I think it's reasonable. It's reasonable if you're someone who's looking for this kind of watch. Absolutely, yes. I want to trade you for something. Because my, my cost is almost the... I know, you bought it from him. So let's trade something so you can make more money on the trade. Yeah, there you right. go. That's what it's all about. It's called a trade show. How much is it, like, Uh, I need 135. What's the best best for the RM? My man can't wear in two Richard Mills. He's like, <laughs> what's the best 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 for the Richard Mill? Yeah, do that again. Hold on. What's the best 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 for the Richard Mill? I would do a what's what's uh, this for sale? Yeah, 490. 390. 390, sorry. 390. Guys, high out of his mind. Loco. <laughs> I was thinking of the price of this one. That's why. I take this, this. I give you this. Woo! What's up? Think. Bueno, bonito, muy barato. Can I get your character? You told me 475, no? The price. Well, however you, it's, how, you can how figure out however you want. Yeah, and, I'm, and I'm getting you out of a dog. No, so, no, no. But I just bought it. Well, you just got it. You bought it from him a while yeah, ago. Right now. Not right now. I no. say he saved your life. <laughs> I should chop his hand off. <laughs> Another Roman buy. He bought a watch that I told him, Roman, please don't buy it. <laughs> So what does he do? He goes and buys it. So our friend here from Mexico was trying to make a deal and I told him, listen, you owe us a favor because Roman bought a watch off you that he should had no business buying. Thank you very much, boss. Think about it. How, what's, what, how much you want? No, I, I was thinking around uh, 50, the price for 50. This is, this is, this is full gold. This is May, not January. <laughs> <laughs> you forgot what month? Yes. <laughs> forgot what month you went. How about this? Yes. Miguelito. Yes. Boom, boom. I give you 10,000 for this. I can't. Think about it. Think about it. Do take take a lap. Think. Come back. Sometimes for people not to make emotional purchases, I'll actually tell them to take a lap around the room, get a little oxygen, and get a little exercise, and come back and rethink the process. How much for the? We'll do something. Yes. Yes. Maybe you make some money, you come back, and you feel more comfortable, and then we do the deal. Yes. What's up, man? What's up, bro? How you doing, man? Uh, you're a new okay. member now. You're, you're, a, you're a new member now? Yeah, new member. New member. New member. Congratulations. Thank you, man. Thank you. How you doing? So, Nazar. Nazar is a kid that reached out to me while watching one of my YouTube videos and really, really insisted to become a watch dealer, and he did. But he still hasn't convinced me to get into an airplane with him because he's a young pilot. Okay. It's not a price right. We get stupid money for this online, like 3800 As a friend, I'm telling you, don't, don't, no, it's not for you. It sounds like a good old sales pitch, but it's not. One of the things we've always done in our company, whether we're selling retail or wholesale, we're not looking for the first sale, the second sale. We're looking forward to selling a customer, be it wholesale or retail, something five years down the line. Work out with me. How much do you need for this one, too? This one, I need, I need 12.8 and I need 18.5 for these. This one's unworn? Yes, yeah, brand new. Here's the card. I can take I can take a hundred dollars off each. The best I can do. The, the, the shit's so marginal. This, this one's a little high. A little high. So what would you say? 12 8? Yeah. I'll do 12 I'll I'll I'll, I'll do 12 6 for this for you. 12, 6. Can yeah. you do 18 on that one? I can't. What's the best you can do? I can't. 18 3. 18 3 is the best I can do. And what about this? This one, this this one, this one. I'm making no money. The guy wants 22 firm. Look, I'll do, I'll do like this. 53,000 for these three. Let me do these two. Okay. Okay. Bro, I walked all around. I came to the conclusion. Oh, the only one here yeah, that fair prices. It's expensive. I know. I should probably readjust my prices then. You got a full gold. It's 50,000 list. Right. The white gold yacht master two. Okay. Right. This is not the best seller, right. but. If you sell it, this is where you make money. Yeah, I know. You know, at thirty thousand, you can you can make money on this watch. Yeah, so that's I'm almost, I'm that's almost tapped out right now. So how much how, how much do you have left to spend? Give me a number, and I'm gonna put you into the proper watch. Fifteen. Fifteen thousand. Okay. Give or take. Okay. So let let me let me make it worth your while. Fifteen thousand. Um. 
I wouldn't mind an AP. I got the diver last time. I sold pretty quick. Yeah, it's AP. <sighs> See, when you say 15 and AP, it's a hard, hard thing. I could, I could, I could push a little bit. Roman, I got a question for you. I got an answer. How are you going to hop in a helicopter and not come in front of me? Because mentally, in a helicopter, I see the ground. That's more dangerous. It is? Yeah. yeah. What if you have an engine failure? You don't have enough, enough room, enough time to find someone to live. You're like 12,000. Yeah, should I trust to get on a plane with him? Y'all got on a helicopter. I wouldn't get on a helicopter. That's my son, Marcus. I know, I met him. I, 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 Okay, by me telling him I'm gonna get on a plane with him is a, actually a bigger deal than you think. Believe it or not, as much travel as I do, I am a very nervous flyer. Yes, I'm okay getting into a helicopter because I see the ground and I feel like I'm in control. But when I'm on a plane in the clouds and the things start shaking, just regular turbines, I start to get really nervous. And the Tsar doesn't fly 737s or 777s or the air big Airbuses. He flies the tiny little planes, and so I don't know. All right, fuck it, I'll get on the plane with you. How, but how do we, you gotta fly into like what, Northeast Airport in Philly or something? I've landed into Philly International. Before. Yeah. I have a video. Turn it on and off. Wow. Yeah, that looks bumpy, bro. It's not that bad. That looks bumpy as well, it, it was a turbulent morning. It was a November morning in Philly. See, no, hold on, no, hold on, no, no, hold on. no, 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 you, lo you lost me, bro. No, 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 I saw that plane shaking. <laughs> you lost me. You, you lost me. He's over Hudson Yards. I mean, okay. All right, I'll get on the plane with this shit. Oh, uh, there's Anthony. Out here buying roller pouches and stuff. So, <laughs> buying them? Uh, watches where I'm looking at a... Marco's looking at an 1101 Mancini. Yeah. No. And then I'm looking at But a, they want, they yeah, want, how much do they want for it? So. You're not even standing up. Shut the f up. Come on up, bro. Oh, you What'd you bring? Not much. I don't want to be in the TV. You didn't, you didn't bring me a, a whole lot of interesting. No, I did not. What do you want for the, is that 5059? Yeah, 45, service sealed. And the brigade type 22. Nine grand. Oh, well, all right, when you get a chance, walk over. I want to show you that Jordan, okay? All right, I'll be over. How much? Seven. How much are you asking for this one? For Le Mans? Uh, 275 or cost. Uh, wow, 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 wow. Thought I had some. Like, it's a nice watch, but it's a fucking 350 yeah. retail watch. 350 retail. Marcus trying to buy himself a richer meal at the show. What? Oh, I know. He said, I got a budget of 200. I'm like, good luck. What do you want for this? The guy wants 135. I gotta give it back. Give it back quick. Hey, I want to see that NBA map. I f***ing love it. How much is that? Uh, for the camera and then how much for me? What I, brand bro? is that? NBA? NBA yeah. Dude, I that love, thing is ridiculous. I love this mm -hmm. You guys seen the Astronomias in person? No. I, I saw them last time I was here with the Ball Harbor. Oh my god. Are they that badass? It's sick. Videos do not do zero. You just can't wear it. Yeah. Yeah, it's just too big. It's, it's gigantic. Anthony, this is a buy for you. How much? 22? <laughs> Bro, this is 2021, not 2015. <laughs> Hashtag watch porn. Dude, my collection is starting to turn from... It started as hype collection when I got yeah. to piece number 16. I went from hype to like... Just... Watch watch. Like actual watches. Dude, aside from this... This is my favorite watch of the show. This? The BBC. Memo to me. Memo to? Yeah. Okay. Two weeks. Okay. Uh, Rome, I'm gonna. Memo made this for two weeks. I'll sell it. It's been sitting on your car lot thirty days. The bank is calling. I need to free up a lot. I don't. The bank doesn't call me. I call. <laughs> I call the bank. But. Uh... This is my favorite watch in the show. And the reason I really? say. The reason I say memo it to me for two weeks is I either sell it for two weeks or I'll, I'll probably buy it. I'll tell you what. At you have it for 30 days and it's yours. You bought it. You can have a private money. Cost you, can, money. You, can, you, can, you can write me a that. check 30 days from now and it's yours. You like apples? How you like them apples? 30 days, you have to pay me in 30 days. Money costs money, inflation. Crypto is going up. So what happened there? Anthony asked me to memo the watch. Now I do memo a lot of pieces out to dealers that I trust and I trust Anthony just the same. I would memo him anything he would like to have on memo, let's say to show to a client or to put in his store. But sometimes, you know, old dogs have some tricks up their sleeves. So the minute Anthony said, hey, listen, 
Uh, Memo to me for two weeks, and in two weeks, if I don't sell, I'll probably buy it myself. I decided to just seal the deal. And I simply went back to my original asking price, and I said, you have 30 days to pay, and the watch is yours. I would love to print you an invoice, but I'm about to throw this printer out of the window. I need my kid to come fix it. It's pulling out the roll. That's a proper swap. Did you buy it? No. Mm -hmm. <laughs> you just bought the best watch you have. Well, one of the best. Oh, shit, it's in the roll. <laughs> that means it's a part of the collection? Is that what that means? Okay. It's all that. Email the invoice to Anthony. Yeah. You know, you know, you know. This is the only person I've ever met that's more full of himself than me, and I'm very full of myself. <laughs> and you know this. You're my hard. side. That's, that's hard. hard. That's hard. That was Wait. So, what, what, what did we decide with the offshore term? Uh, I think I'm gonna sell it to Nico. Who? Nico. Who? Uh, private. Not not that Nico. Pico. Nico. In Ohio. See, see you notice how. In the beginning, there was like a morning rush. A lot of people came. We did some business. It's what time? Just See that? Yeah. Marcus. See how quickly it turns? It off. And this is part of the reason why I hate trade shows because it's like two hour rush and then just silence. Hey, live from Watchbox, Florida, Josh Panos. <laughs> so when are you going to open an office in Miami? Why? I don't need an, I don't want an office here, bro. York Heisig. Oh, jeez. Could be yours for a bargain price of $18,500. And I'll kiss you on both cheeks if yeah, you I'll buy pass it. pass on that. Yeah, thanks. <laughs> you could have fake bought it at least. <laughs> yeah, I mean, on camera. So. Oh, it's not really. No. No, no this no. you don't need this. Year. How about this stupid thing for $27,000? There be a. Conjar two door, full set. What is it? Michael from Watchbox, who's the head buyer there. He's been in the industry longer than I have, but buying experience-wise, me and him are literally the same person. Nine out of 10 watches that I would pull out of my showcase, he would literally tell me what I paid. This guy is super sharp, and very often times he'll reach out to me and I'll reach out to him on certain pieces to say, hey, what do we pay? It's a good relationship to have. It's a, it's a two-door, it's got a conjure on it. Conjure box, conjure everything. And it could be yours for Two two seven six four seven nine. This I bought stupid cheap, and this I bought expensive. So, throw a number for me at the pair for the pair. Let me just see the stupid cheap one. Nah, I want to sell them both because I'm gonna ask all the money for the. I'm gonna ask. I'm gonna ask all the money for the I blue rose. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I'm gonna throw them. Please, sir, can I have the cheap one? This is hideous. No, it's not. What do you mean, rose gold blue dial? Yeah. Talk to me. I have no idea. Who buys this stuff? No, I'm definitely not buying it. No, then Little Gobber will hate you. Actually, ah, uh, here. How this, much is... Nah, this is you. Is this is you. Interest? I want you to give me a number. No idea. This one you never fucking answered me on. So now let me tell you what I paid. I swear I did. No, you did not. 227-9802. Or you answered too late. That's good to Okay, how cheap do you buy these? I made like 15 grand. <laughs> I'm not joking. Look. Yeah. Okay, so 16. Is that box papers? Uh, box. I'll take it. The first gold Panerai One ever made. Love that. And it's complete with box and papers, never polished. Original patina. You like that? Oh I'm such a good original salesperson. Patina. I'm trying to. I'm trying to be a salesperson. Like Michael. He was doing. He was doing. He was doing it when I was in. Original. When I was in grade school. I was doing this when I was in grade school. Three, two, seven, six, two, eight, eight. Anna, what's the cost on a Pan 140? And this, I just got. You didn't see this yet. Mini repeater, that's the Oman Opera House. Enamel dial. You should have sent me this a while ago. No, I sent you one without diamonds. Right. I sold that one for seventy some thousand dollars. How, how much? 14.4, Michael. Complete full set. All right, bye. I'm making a thousand bucks. I paid 13.4. I was going to say 14. Nah, let me, let me get the 14.4, please. I'm, I lost two grand there. I got to make up for it somehow. This one? Uh, this one is also cheap. I just had it all done up, so it's pretty. Retail ready, as you guys like to call it. 227-7169. This. 
this this I want eighty eight thousand right now. Services. Can't find so 67, them. Right? No, nope, you can't. All right, I think we're done. I think we're done. Thanks, sir. Thank you. I'll get that invoice. Michael. Good man. How are you? Yes, I'm eating milk. Adrian, how did we do it? Quantity. What's that? Watch box. You had a breach. Where's the breach? Breach? Yeah, they oh, bridge. bridge. Oh, I sold it. Sold it. Sold it. Uh, what, what do you think we do? We sell stuff. What about the IWC? Yeah, this we can. I think that one around 16.5 maybe, I'm going to say. Yeah, the retail is 30 some thousand now. cheap? No. 6,000. Can I see? Yeah. Take that out. I paid 5500 I'm not giving you stupid prices, you know what I mean? These don't put it here. You break nah, it's it fine. No, it's a membrane box. It's okay. Oh, sh**. He's breaking out the loop. 19.3. 25. 19.3. 19.3. 3. Plus 6. Plus 10. Plus 30. 65. 3. This? This you can make money on. I'm gonna make money here. Box papers? You know, if this came from you, you probably never gave the guy. No, 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 no. It just, I don't know who the fuck. I eventually it came from it, but I. Yeah, from Eddie. No box, no papers, it's tough, bro. Like, I'd rather have this. No, take these. Take no, these, this, and we this, do. This is expensive? No. I'll be stuck with this forever. 55,000 my cost. Do your numbers. 317. What's 55? It's exactly. 18 cents on a dollar. That's I know, I, I know, I know. I, I believe you. I, I believe you. I want to do it. There's nothing in here that I cannot sell without trades. This is rare. You can't find this. This I just bought literally last week. The only difficult thing here is this. And this is cheap at 10 cents on the dollar. Right? I know, I know. I'll give you 10 grand. Adrian, help me out here. This is super liquid. Yeah. Make money. This is this is price right. This is liquid. This I this I want to move. This is the only thing we really want to move, you know. And this was a trade too. You know what I mean? So. Um, what is this graph? It's 485 Swiss francs list. What is that? Confirmed. Yeah. Piece unique. It was made for some freaking royalty. It's better than this. No, you crazy? You know what I should do with this? I should put it in my auction and try to sell it for you but I don't want I don't want to you know I don't want to buy it Bro, this is the most like me yeah I know you know how many of them I had take this for no bro I can sell you this for, I can sell you this thing eight, 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 eight. no bro I can sell you this for six and this is gold Stop it, bro. This, this is gold this is gold too it's a white it's white gold blade. no I don't want it this is white gold I don't I don't want it bro I have that I, pay, I paid like five thousand it's not cursing no this this I don't want no, I buy that if you take this and... No. Then buy it for 30. <laughs> I mean... 28. No. I buy for 30 if you take this. No. I, uh... I'll just do these. It's okay. No problem. But 28 is cheap on this watch. You should just buy it. What's the difference? I bought enough stuff from you. Okay, so I'm going to build this. Build me all the other stuff. If you want, if you want, I'll build you this at 28. It's cheap. You should take it. Because you have the platinum. Please. No. I would not pay more than... Okay, I, pay, I paid five okay, for that think one. Think about this. Hold this here. Hold it. What am I thinking about? I have nothing to think about. I picked up for 30. No. No, this doesn't matter to me, bro. I want to be into this for, for, I want to be into this for the same price. You know what I mean? To me, it's like you have to steal it. I was asking 130. <laughs> it was ridiculous bro, on the show. I know today's weird, but keep going. Keep going. I saw Titanium with people asking for 125. I know. Same one. Ah, this watch hurt so bad. I got offered this watch a few weeks ago and I was a little hesitant about buying it based on where it came from and the fact that the head of the watch was on a different strap and the condition of the watch. I was a little bit concerned about it. And then a friend of ours brings it to the show and it was a really good deal and I was a little, uh, a little envious of that. It's a tubeless Richard Mill on the floor and it's mine. Think yeah. about Yeah, I mean, I'm, I'm, if 130, I, I mean, I know what I offered on the watch. I mean, I can't come up that much on it. I mean, I would, I would, I would be at, I would be at 105, me personally. You if don't want to trade it? We, I mean, listen, if we can, I really want this watch really bad, but we're $25,000 off on watches that are already so marginal. So I got to really think 
what I could trade in, in my showcase that's gonna make up that margin and make sense. That's a real challenge in our industry. <laughs> and it has a black strap. It's whatever it's worth. Well, it's definitely not this strap. It's from a I'm, I'm shocked that this actually fit. The screw size is the same, but somebody trimmed the sides. I mean, that's crazy. What do you want to do? You want to hold it and come back or what? You want to see if you, what you want to trade for? Or? Let me think. Let me think. I told him to look at it this way. It's the cheapest Richard Mill on the floor and it's platinum. Yeah, I know. It's 40 pieces. Nobody else has winning it. Alright, I'll come back later. So needless to say, I did not get the RM5 Philippe Massa in platinum. It was too expensive and we just couldn't make a deal work. I'm filling the cases back up. I'm excited. Where do I put this? Uh, I guess, I guess, I guess, I guess this guy can come out. So can I make you an offer on the whole thing? Sir, yes, Papi, this is too heavy to take to Houston. I this, is, this is, this is our end user's prices. 10,000? How, how did you figure? I know 36 is new, but why? Nobody has it. Nobody wants Nobody it. Nobody wants it. <laughs> okay. We'll just put the price, we'll give you one price. 90,000? Let me yeah. do my numbers now. Let me just add the sticky notes. No, no, don't add the, no, you can, you know what I'm gonna do? I'm gonna f you all up, right? <laughs> I'm gonna f you all up. You can add the price. Sticky notes, that, that, man. That's it, you're done. <laughs> that's the point. 140? <laughs> Good comeback. Like I'm a 94 without this. Without this? I mean, the problem, problem is, is this card is destroyed. It's okay, Papi, just took a little shower. <laughs> took a little shower. Time up. Somebody <laughs> went, did, did this <laughs> with it. Took a little shower. It's more than a little shower. Okay. Hold on, Adrian, let me try something real quick. Huh. <laughs> <laughs> like, they, they pop up. Like, like why? Ricky Maduro. <laughs> like why they do this? I guess you have to carry all that to Houston. Or you can sell it right here, right now, if the price is right. How much is that Yama? I could do 18. Card? Card, full set, box papers, 2019, new hands. Can't beat it. 18. Oh, okay, 17.5. No. No, I can't. I really, I can't. I can't. Wait. Puppy, I'm giving you this for 11.5. I know. It's okay, you don't want no take. I'll give you. No, no, no. 6,000, you're going to kick on the river today. I'll tell you what. We'll flip a coin. I win, you pay me 7,000. You win, you pay me You pay me six. Thank you so much. We have to take on risk. You have to take on risk. Flip the coin. Anybody got a quarter of a coin? Anybody? Anybody? Everybody's too f***ing rich. Nobody has change? A coin. Pesos, whatever. I don't care. A peso. A no cash. Coin? Anybody? Huh? Ah, my man. That's good. All right. All right. So, heads you win. I mean, you call it. Heads for me. Heads for you. All right. You win. It's six thousand difference. You lose. It's seven thousand dollar difference. You said card, right? Heads. You you got heads. Everybody heard it. Look, two sided coin. You got the tails. You got the heads right there. No camera. Boom. All right. I win. <laughs> he doesn't know how lucky I am. <laughs> Can we do it again? Uh, no. Let me check that coin, man. Let yeah, but check that. You can keep the coin. It's yours. It'll be a reminder. You just... <laughs> Thank you. Big fan of you guys. What's your name? How you doing? Fernando. Fernando. Roman, uh, famous Adrian, bro. Pleasure to meet you. I love that. He said Roman and famous Adrian. Finally. Yes. Finally. Man, we always famous. talk about you guys. We this is the good guy, this is the bad you guy. You see the great market too? Yes. You see when he's so dead? When I We're always talking that. about you. Always. Yeah. Introduce like, me to your videos. You know when you watch a TV show and you talk about your friends about Game of Thrones, you do that with your show. <laughs> I like it. Yeah. John, John Snow? What did you think of my Tony Montana accent? Is that good? Yeah, it's, it's, okay. it's, it's okay. It's good. It's good. It could be better. It could be better. Yeah. You're going to watch this show. They share so much information, man. You got to take notes. I'm going to see show. Yeah, you're going to have to stop bleeping shit out at this point. <laughs> We're, we're trying to sell this, 11.5. I don't know if you're interested. This is, I, this is, I, I, don't, I don't know. Last one I paid, same watch, paid much cheaper. This, no watch, no, no, no books, no papers, I can do it. 34. Can we just buy one cheaper pet all day? No, I have no idea on these. Huh? I have no clue on these. 
and all my numerals. Oh, yeah, that's yeah, gonna, yeah. That's gonna be, hold on, that's gonna be a little, that's gonna be a little tough. No. But, Ian, when we do this video, you're gonna do the sound effect. <laughs> yeah, that's, that's, that's a lot of loose. You know, uh, Felix? Ah, uh, Felix. Karim? Karim? Karim, yeah, I know. He can fix this. This, this right there. He fixes it. We can, we can, we can fix, fix it too, but... Are you off? Yeah, we just... It's a pain in the ass to fix, but like, you gotta sit yeah, there. Yeah, it, it, it's the time. It, it, it takes time, man. How about this one? 85. That's Adrian's department. Not for us. Not for you. Can't tough. Uh, I don't... It's tiny. Tiny, tiny, tiny. Can we take a picture with you guys? Let's go. Sure. Yes, please. Thank you guys. Nice meeting you. Pleasure. Good luck with everything. Good luck with everything. Thank you, Adrian. 31,000. 31, Yo, what are you driving, bro? What are you, what are you doing on that? Yeah. No, we sold them. You gotta shave it. You gotta shave it. Yeah. Gotta shave it. Bro, the, the hair is the beauty of the whole We just have. Thank you, Roman. Are we doing the trade? The 35 with the How much you want for the carbon? Two sixty-five with paper. The right money. What else you have? I have a Mantini. With titanium. Titanium, but with the, with the um, service fire case. Oh, I. You remember you saw that? I no luck. But I have the titanium also. Yeah. Yeah. How much for the whole the, thing? The whole thing. Two seventy-five. Two seventy-five. Your client, are you interested in a Grubel? I like it. I like it too. I have one. I know. I saw that one. We could trade. How much you want for the Longay? 85. Box paper? Box paper. Caja Papeles. Okay. I don't know where to go with these guys. I mean... I love this watch too. Like I really, really love this watch, and the carbon one is insane. I had this one. Yeah, so you have you, have, you can make earrings. There's one online for 84. Yeah. yeah so where am I going? I got to be at least 75. I want the watch for stock. I'll do a trade with you. Want to figure it out? Let me know. Yeah. All right, 20,000 plus that, and then on these, I want to give you the Ferrari. And maybe take these till July. Want to do that? I can give you this. Okay. But that one I have a okay, this very, is very this strong customer. That's fine. This is a complete also, right? Super. Okay, so I, I have an extra truck. Okay, so write me a memo on this and then, well, figure, figure that out first. Because I want to show that to somebody, actually. But actually, I'm more excited about this one. Figure this out, I'll come back, okay? Green GMT. Hey, the the Bumblebee naked appeal. is possible in 19. Can you do 19.5? 18. What 18? The Bumblebee. This is a paid 19.2 to him. Oh, this is reverse auction. Oh, fuck. I like the other way. We just bought it from him, 19.2. Green camo. No, I don't have a Come on, you don't have customer. You create what, customer. What's the best? You go on YouTube. <laughs> you film what you film yourself every day so the world can see what you do, and then you have customer. Do you want a green GMT? I give it to you cheap. How much? 40. 48. Eight. That's a good price. Should have bought it, Miguelito. Expensive. Everybody's asking over 50. What's expensive? Everybody here, over 50. I know that watch. It's from, it came from Mexico. Which one? That GMT, no, I think. From no. Eduardo. 78, no. I buy. Yes. Uh, no. 78, I buy. The best, true best. Listen, I know. On call, I sell at 85, like this. Somebody needs it. We are saving. Your life and your and year. And we're saving your life with this watch. Saving. You see the smile on Lozado's face? He's still smiling about the sale. This 79. No. No. So what the push best best? 81, I'll meet him. 81. He's the best 79. He's the best no, no, best I no, can. No, no, True best. I okay, I'll pay you 100 for this. No problem. Give me good prices. I am. I gave you 81 is a good price on that watch. It's, 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 79. No. It's full links. No, it's full. It's missing. No. <coughs> What's missing? One only, but. Uh, no. Fuck. 79 now. 
79.5. No problem. I'll give you that. I'll give you that one for one. I'll give you 103 for that one. Figure, what, figure Take that 79. I'll give you 103 for that one. And the Robert Daytona? On so this, they, they don't make this dial anymore, you know? Yes. 48. New. New? It's not new. new. No. Card? New card. New card. New card. Well, I was thinking around 44. Me too. No, yes, it's... Let me go pick a check and I come back with you, okay? okay? We need to sell them something where there's margin. So okay. we can make money on this and so we can make money on the other thing. Up? What? We paid 75 for it. Okay. So I don't I, want it 70. 81 is best. Okay. It would net us 80. Yeah. Okay. So 81 is best. What else? Um, well, I'm going to see if he'll take the white gold yacht master too. Maybe something else. He wants, he wants to buy very carefully. He wants to rip shit. Don't we all? I don't know. I get it. End of day one, I invited Adam, Anthony, Marco, his crew, uh, a couple of our other friends. The wristwatcher was there to a dinner at a Russian restaurant called Le Q in Sunny Isles. Great time, took the ultimate Instagram shot. I mean, talk about flexing. I don't usually do that stuff, but there were just so many watch guys there with so many watches. It, was, it would be a shame not to take that shot. Uh, we did the math with agents. There was something like over $4 million on that plate in watches, which was pretty insane. The first day of the show was really, really good. We sold close to 60 pieces just the first day. Case looks full. What are you talking about? It's f***ing half the shit is gone. That's okay. Dude, I emptied out two of these. And I made its way across the hall. Originally. Yeah. Yes. You know what he does? When he can't sell something, he just gives it to me. He's like, you can sell it. It's good to have friends in the industry. Uh, oftentimes, just because you have a watch that you're having a hard time selling doesn't mean it's not somebody else's treasure. So the dealers I do business with uh, will often leave a few pieces with another dealer and vice versa just to give someone else a crack at something because we all have different clients and oftentimes, like I said, one man's trash is another man's treasure. I love that tutor. How much is one of those selling for these days? Under five grand? No. No more? More. Shot Over up. six. Wow. Day before, I talked to Pepe and tried to work out a deal, a trade deal on a Lange data graph. So now he came to my booth to see if we can make the trade happen. Pepe, so we have the deal on that or no? No. What about a cash price? 70,000, I'll buy it. Pick something from me, we can trade for something else. It doesn't matter to me. This one, I take uh, 30,000. You want cheap turbines? I have many. So this one, the 37,000. This one, 27,000 turbion. This one, the retail, uh, 387. I want the, the Zenith. Zenith, 28,000. This turbion, a retail, 387. I want 55. Pepe, this is a stupid deal. This retails 485,000 Swiss franc. Piece unique. Box, papers, letter, made for some royalty. I don't know what it is. I'll sell you the watch for 68,000. And 12 cents on a dollar. Brand new. Bluffy piece. The fucking emeralds are worth 30,000. It was actually made for a man. But. How much you want for the jewel? This one? Uh, 235. 220? 225. 235. 235. Wait, my ID inside. He put my picture inside. Oh. He's gonna see who you think. <laughs> this? I'm thinking about it. Okay, because I want the Lang. As usual, second day, the trade show got slow. We had some time during lunch, and uh, my buddy Adam took me to meet a couple of his friends local that were also in the watch business, but they also dealt in other special things. Yeah, where are you? I just got here. Oh, I, I'm, wa I'm walking up. I just come inside. Okay. This is it. Hi, how are you? Are you here to see David? Uh, how, how are you? How are you, David Rosen? Hey, nice to meet you. Hi, how are you? Where's my buddy Adam? You said he's inside somewhere. Uh, Adam. Go yes, I'm here. Federico. Not in here. Are we in the right place? I know we're not in the right place. I don't know if we're in the right place. What's the name of this place? 
Oh, we went to the wrong place. Oops. We got the address, but we went into a Prestige Motors pop-up shop. I actually know David from Prestige Motors, but that's not what we had our appointment. Well, we're heading over to Kinetic. They just happened to be next to each other. We made a left instead of a right. Bro, I walked in there. They walked me with open arms. Look at this. Hi, how are you? How are you, my friend? What's up, man? Good morning. Good morning. Good morning. How you doing? See, th this is me right here. Team right? Oh, right. This, this is so me. Yeah. That's like my grill car. So what's the concept here? Like, I mean, this is just... Come in and buy expensive toys. Art, cars, watches, purses. This, this is a great idea. Yeah. It's so clean. Your eyes able to focus on like one thing as opposed to like being sensory overload. We lost Adrian. He's you know? he's a car guy. Dude, look at the cars though. Like I, so like I was never. This is a grill. These, grill are, car. these are all like restored, right? Or this car was bought at our end about Sotheby's. seven months ago. It's pristine car. Ding, 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 ding. That, so what's what's the sticker or something like this retail? This will be around five hundred thousand. I'm a big James. I'm a big James Bond fan. So for me, like this is it. Hey Ian. This is it. Name's Bond. This, yeah. James Bond. <laughs> In my best Russian accent. <laughs> this is insane. Very This is a true stick. Yeah. Look at this. Like, things were so much simpler back then, man. It's crazy. I love this steering wheel. Dude, can you imagine cruising down in this? Like, Dude, this steering wheel like feels the man so good. This. You're just a man driving. Like, the person who had this car right. was a special person. Right. You know what I mean? Right. At the time. 100%. Dude, not even, no power windows. Like, this is just like you in the road, you know? That's what I love about these cars. Like, there's no, there's no aids to help you. There's no traction control. I think I'm gonna change my business model yeah. to less is more. Can we get Roman into cars, please? Oh my God. Wow. Look at that interior. Oh my God. Look how, like, the technology increased a little bit over the years. Like, there's way more gadgets and... This is this is this is this is pre big boardroom executives sitting in a conference room talking about how they're gonna f their client. You know what I mean? <laughs> this is this is art. This is passion. Dude. You know what I mean? Back in the day, like Dude, Roman, don't I would denim and white. Oh god. I'm being careful. These are good investment cars. They 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 used to go for like four hundred thousand. Now they are under three hundred. I think they're, they're going to go up, go up again. So how much is this going? This one? Two nine. So it's less than this. It's insane. Yeah, maybe work a trade. <laughs> this, it's insane. It's less than this. It's less than the, the watches. Adam, would you say this is the fastest car you ever drove? Driven? Yeah. Dude, I was putting, they let me drive this yesterday. And getting onto the bridge, I had like a minute of daylight where like there wasn't enough traffic. In like second, going into third gear, I gave it probably like 34% throttle. Really? The turbo spool up like very low RPM. So it hits you immediately. Yeah. And you're like, Fuck. instant thrust. Yeah. Instant. Because the power, there's no tire spin, it's immediate. Instant, you know? yeah. Just I mean, instant. We, we had like two seconds for me to put a little bit of power down, but it was enough to understand what this car is about. Yeah. You know? At top speed, this thing will run out of gas in 15 minutes. Really? Correct, right. yeah. Wow. So 16 Actually, minutes. when he floor it, the windows went up. Oh, yeah. That was the part. We had the windows down. I started, I, I didn't even floor it. I gave it like 40, maybe 50% throttle. And the windows started going up because they want you to be more aerodynamic. The car's smart, you know? But even if you look at the interior, the cool thing about these cars and like what I like about them, it's still very simple inside because they want you to be like one with the road. Yeah. They don't want too much yeah, distractions, yeah. you know? Like you're driving this car, like you're focusing yeah. on what you're doing, you know? At least it even has a cup holder. So, um, Bro, you can feel yourself driving this, right? Mm-hmm. <laughs> yes. <laughs> Gentlemen, let's make a pact here. Yes. Give him that little push. I would like to own this. So you have the RM. This is more than that car. This is more than a badass mansion. I mean, honestly, the, the, the black and red, I don't think I would have it any other way. I'm not a red guy. Ah, but no, but the black and red, red, I mean, cars. come on. No, it's cool. I like, I like the two-tone aspect of it. This is insanity. Can you start it? I want to hear it.
is insane. I was always honest with myself and everybody when it comes to these kind of cars, like him, you, you I'm assuming, you have appreciation for how it drives, with the engine, the technology behind it. For me, I look at these things but more you know, as more of a flex, but I know a lot of these things are great investment too, so. He and I are into like weird esoterics and vintage cars that like, yeah. if you don't know what it is. Exactly, so, but you guys. It's a thousand dollar car, but to everybody else, well, it's like 10,000. I'm like that with watches, like, right? I get into the mechanics of a watch, mostly modern stuff, right. not even vintage, right? But with cars, you either are a car guy, and if you're a car guy like you or him, like, He'll tell you about aspirator this and this and that, and I'm like, huh? Yeah. It looks cool, right? Yeah. So out of everything here, like that, that would be me. It's got the vintage vibe, it's got the Ferrari vibe, it's got the look, right. you know? I mean, look, don't get me wrong. You know, once maybe I put three of my kids through college and marry them all, maybe this will be the next thing, but for now it's like... Yeah. There are different sensations. You know, yeah. it's a car, car, it's rough, uh, it gives you a tickle, you know? It's right. like, well, we're talking about that yesterday. Yeah, that's just not going to be a... You automatically get transported to like a different yeah. time. That's not going to be a comfortable right. ride, I understand, but... It's not your daily drive. Exactly. You know? That's a car you take out on the weekend and you're cruising and you're like, wow, I'm back in my... 75. Yeah. Shit, I'm driving like the pinnacle. Yeah, yeah, the soundtrack to this is going to be the old Miami Vice song. I'm telling you. <laughs> Chippy. All right, let's go take a look at some watches. Thank you so much for taking thank the time. You, my friend. All right, I'm glad we made this connection. Adam, thank, thank you. you. Thank you very much. All right. Uh, you, I'm going to take these. Uh, shoot me an invoice with wire info, and I'll, I'll have my guys uh, from the office uh, wire you guys. I had a great time at Kinetic. It was a pleasure meeting those guys. The store was unbelievable. I love the concept behind it. Everything about it was great. We went back to the show. The show ended up being really, really good. We did over a million in sales at that show. We moved a lot of pieces. And the best part about finishing the show, it was time for me to finally take a very well overdue vacation and spend some time with my family. Hi. You ready to start vacation? Yeah. I don't have to go to work again. I know. Right, let's go. It was a long, hard week for me that started on Monday and ended the following Tuesday. It's nice to take time off. It's nice to spend time with my family. Of course, that vacation flew by fast. It was very, very short. And it was back to the grind and back to the gray market. All right, guys, before you go, uh, you guys killed it in the comments last time, sharing the video, liking the video, subscribing. I'm going to pick the winners for the $500 giveaway. And uh, sorry if I pronounced the names wrong, but um, well, the first name's easy. It's the Town Watch. Uh, thank you for commenting. That was a, it was a very nice comment about me selling the RM, so I do appreciate that. Uh, Corey Childress. And the last winner is Live Live. So guys, uh, we're gonna leave that in the description below. Definitely reach out to us. Uh, my email, aserrano at Luxury Bazaar. We'll plug that in below or uh, Ian's email as well, ian at Luxury Bazaar. All right guys, thank you so much for watching. Congrats to the winners. And uh, we'll definitely be sending you the money right away as soon as you guys reach out. Like, share, subscribe. Don't forget to hit the bell and we'll see you next week on Gray Market. Right? Is that? <laughs>